Yo, what up guys? I got a beast vapor setup for you guys right here. The game is kind of getting stale. It's getting a little bit old. So uh, that's why we try new things out. And with the help of you guys in the comments, I definitely do read the comments. I take them into consideration. And that's why I'm bringing this class setup here for you guys today. And uh, I think it was Levy Barnard, dude. That guy is like on point with like every single comment he makes, man. Uh, he definitely does uh, give me some really good class setup. So definitely shout out to Levy Barnard on that one. Uh, but he did say to use recon site because it definitely mitigates that record that you get with the vapor and with the recon site it definitely does change everything man especially on the grab and the rampart definitely does help as well on the vapor don't get me wrong though i don't think it works on every single gun so don't go out there putting on the recon site just because you think that you saw this video and like oh it should help me with this weapon you know what i mean i like to test things out before i use them so that's why i present them to you guys and i like to use them extensively before i show it to you guys and i could definitely say that putting on the recon site on the vapor is definitely a game changer as well So definitely try it out if you haven't. Uh, then I'm rocking rapid fire so we can reduce our time to kill. High caliber so we can get those headshots and re further reduce our time to kill. Then we got stocks so we can strafe left and right in those gunfights because mobility is key and being able to strafe left and right will definitely help you win those gunfights. Then we got stim shots so we can recover faster. Then we got scavenger so we can replenish our ammo. And gung ho so we can fire faster after sprinting. Then dead sounds to keep our footsteps silent and so that the enemy does not hear ours. So yeah guys, you guys definitely got to try this vapor setup right now. Now, this is looking really great after the 1.21 update and, and one big tip that i do have for using this setup is to pre-aim around those corners every corner try to pre-aim especially in areas where you know it's heavily populated with enemies because that's the weakness with this gun overall is just in close quarter combat when you're aimed in and, and your field of vision is certainly obscured because of the recon site so i highly recommend just pre-aiming around those corners where you know there's going to be enemies and then you want to hip fire so hip firing when you're really up close is definitely going to help you uh stand a chance against those enemies and you're going to see me do that a couple times in this gameplay where it definitely does save my life uh, so yeah guys i hope you guys learned something in today's video don't forget to drop a like subscribe if you're new around here turn on notifications i'm not just saying that you better do it i want to see who's doing it in the comments down below and uh i'll love you forever by the way and i will see you guys in the gameplay peace it should be coming up these stairs right here someone's gonna peek over here in this corner because he knows i'm here I'll take it. Sometimes it's not worth uh, healing yourself in the in certain situations. Okay, no one's coming up right. Okay, we got right here mid. Dude, no way! Okay, that wasn't a quad, but still. <laughs> oh my gosh. Dude, those little moments just get you so excited. Yo, teammate putting in work right there. Okay, I gotta grab these scavenger packs. Ooh, you almost got me. No, 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 no. I'm pre-aiming, uh, pre-firing that dude. Gotta watch my back here. You know what? I'm gonna go down this way. Put more distance between me and the enemy. That should get me an advantage. Yo, they're all spawning back there. Ooh. Laying the smack down. This might be stupid to push. Oh, yeah, I see him right there. Yo. Oh, man. I'm persistent. We got our sniper's nest. I'm calling this in ASAP. Some right there on mid. Okay, let me try and take this guy down. Yep, we got our strike team. Hold up. I think that guy's going to try and uh, flank me. Okay, I'm getting out of here. Pre-aiming. Pre-aiming. Okay. You made your point. I'm getting out of here. Instead, I'm going to try and circle their spawn, which would be around this way. Okay, no one's spawning over here. Oh, they're actually back there. Let's not get too excited here. Ooh, there's two of them. This will be a good flank. Nice easy kill for me. All right, I'll take it. 
They're spawning back here still. Your sniper's nest has been destroyed. Okay, he's going this way. He's he's gotta be pushing this way if he's not going that way. There he is. Got him! Yo, the recon side on this thing really gives you some good uh, field of vision. We just called in our strike team. I think that's a wrap for the other team. All right. I haven't even put my tech beam down yet. Oop, I see somebody. Oh, no. They really just took down that. Did they take control of my strike team? As long as they didn't take control of my strike team, I'll be okay. Like, I'm not going to complain. Let's go. Man, if I didn't have the recon site, I probably would not have that much, uh, you know, capability of seeing where they're at. Or, I mean, uh, accuracy. All right, spawns have flipped for sure. Let's go, baby. Let's go. We got another strike team. Try and hack that, baby. It's pushing to their spawn again. I'm looking at that mini-map. Whoa. Let's go. Woo, that was a nice little athletic move right there. Nice little jump shot. Come on, strike team, lead the way. Strike team, finish it off. Come on. What am I what am I paying you for? Come on, man. I worked so hard for my strike team, but they oh my god, whatever. I'm not complaining. What I get? 42 in 3, 14 KD. You really gotta learn how to pick and choose your gunfights. You can't really rush like you're using an SMG. So, oh, god. Man, we really could have had a good start right there, but also don't forget to strafe in those gunfights. I used to be one of those players to jump shot all the time, but no, the secret is in uh, strafing. Dude, come on, man. Am I, did I just get flanked again? The flanker is getting flanked. All right, we can't go that way because of that uh, reactor fence or whatever you call it, man. This game has just way too much stuff inside. Dude, yes. I mean, this game has way too many uh, different things going on in the game. You know, it's hard to keep track of everything. All right. Predict there's going to be someone right there. Dude, the recon side is just too damn accurate. Too accurate. All right, let me put this here. So when my teammates die, I should be getting some points for it. I'm going to pre-aim. Pre-aiming around those corners is important when you're using a gun like this. See how I kind of just let them run right, right by me? Hold on, let's back up. Let's get get with our teammates. Because you never know if they're going to be flanking you. Where they're going to be next. But yeah, the, the recon site definitely adds more flexibility to your game. You know, you're not just limited to uh, close range gunfights. Just like that. Adds a little bit more accuracy to your game. Make sure to pre-aim around those corners. Okay, we should be safe in this area because I'm looking at the positioning of my teammates. We're all in the same side of the map here. Okay, whoever put that uh, little seeker mine should be around here somewhere. Dude, teammate! Ah, I can heal myself right away. Ooh, that was close. That was really close. And I wasn't able to heal myself. Ooh, we got we got one guy like right here. Is he down here with us? Yes, he is. There's another one right here. Two actually. We gotta get out of here. Put this down. Okay, he's coming. Is he gonna go this way? Pre aim. Where did he go? Calling this UAV. Okay, he's not around here anymore. Alright, this is going to be a good flank. No, don't let me die to that, please. Alright, let's go heal ourselves. Reload. Alright, I'm going to go here, actually. Teammate just died here. It's pre-aim. Right there. There's one right there. I saw him mid. He's going to be pushing right. 
I'm so close. Okay, he's going to go around for the flank. I'm going to try to meet him over there. I'm going to wait for him like right here. He should be he should be running this way. See, it's all about predicting the enemy movement. If you see them going one way, try to cut them off. And uh, stop them in their flanks. I don't know if that made sense, but you guys get it. All right, we got our sniper's nest. Good stuff. Hopefully they don't try and... Oh, my goodness. Try and uh, hack it. So I'm playing at a distance right now, obviously. That's how you use this weapon to its strength. You know, you don't really want to push too hard. Oh, there's... Oh, they're right there. I got to watch my back. No, no, no. Ah, shoot. Ugh. You know, what I did wrong there, I think I was just reloading. I got caught reloading or, you know, using my stim shot. That's what happened right there. All right. I, there you go. There you go. That's what I want to do. When you when you get close to the enemy like that and you're using the a gun like the vapor, hip firing would be your best option because when you aim in it might be already too late. Teammate just died. That guy was weak. I'm gonna push their spawn right now. Actually, I'm gonna check this area first right here. I don't think he's gonna. I don't think he's gonna challenge. Let's hop out teammate right here. Woo, that was close. A little show and go. Okay, let's go into their spawn. Oh my goodness. I took my time with that one too. Let's go on this UAV. Oh, right behind me. Oh my god, way too late. Spawn. That's what you call a straggler when somebody's just all by themselves and they're not doing anything like flanking. Okay, come on, Turbo. Get up. Come on now. There you go. All right. We know where they're spawning in from. I don't know why teammate went that way. Dude, recon is just lasering through. He's going to be right there. Staircase. This should be another one. Dude. Oh, my goodness. Grab slam. Clutch grab slam right there. I was about to die. Teammate was about to die. That dude even had body armor on. That was crazy. That was crazy stuff, man. What did we get? 30, 9, and 7. Not too bad, man, against these master prestiges, man. Ooh, recon side would be perfect right here. See that? Also, don't forget to strafe. Oh, right behind me. You know, of course, it's all situational. I probably could have zoomed in right there, but I didn't want to. I don't like zooming in when I'm in a mid mid gunfight. Should be another one. There should be another one there. I just have a feeling because that's where they're spawning in from. Notice how I'm just pre-aimed most of the time. So what happens if I rush without pre-aiming? That is what happens right there. I knew that was going to happen. I was just showing it for example. So that's why you got to pre-aim when you're using the recon site. Dude. Close quarter combat, emergency purposes only, hip fire. That's my answer right there. Strafe, hip fire in close quarter combat. Not strafe in close quarter combat, but... Again, I strafed. All right, let's put this down. Hopefully, we can get our score streaks a lot faster. Where's this guy? There he is. Got him. Pre-aimed that. They should be coming around here just based on my teammates' position. Right on cue. There's somebody in the trailer. He's coming. Pre-aim that. Another one. Dude, recon side is just too good on this part of the map. Oh my goodness. It's unstoppable. The vapor and the recon site. Dude, you get like really amazing accuracy. All right, let's use this now. Nothing. There you go. We got that strike team. And we're on a merciless too while we're at it. All right, I'm just going to go for the flank. This is probably super risky, but I'm going to do it anyway. Let's check their spawn. Ah, oh, yep. That was stupid. That was stupid. But learn from my mistakes, you know. I, I, I don't claim to be a pub stomper or perfect. This is a 
a learning channel first, you know what I'm saying? I'm not here to impress anybody. If I make mistakes, you got to learn from it. I want you to try to absorb as many things as possible from watching me play. I think I saw somebody with him, so he can't be the... Whoa, right behind me. All right, someone coming mid. Perfect. Perfect. Again, remember, close crit, uh, quarter combat. You got to learn how to hip fire. Let's check left. All right, perfect. Got a UAV. Okay, spawns flipped. I got you, teammate. Teammates are filling the lanes pretty perfectly right now. Couldn't be any happier. I got you, teammates. I got you. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, my goodness. I was focused way too much on that line of sight to the point where I didn't realize that my teammates to my left died, and that's how I got flanked. But what did we get? 47 and 7. Dude, we are killing it with the Vapor, and we got the best play of the game. Uh, yeah, guys. Try out the Vapor with the Recon Sight. It's definitely also a game changer. I said the same thing as well with the Rampart and the Grav. But it's it, like I said, it's mostly how you use the gun. So when you're on a bigger map that has longer lines of sight, just like firing range right here, you want to keep your gunfights to a distance as much as possible. But if you're in those close quarter combat on a smaller map or just any map in general, just remember to pre-aim around those corners and be ready to hit fire. Uh, so yeah, guys, I hope you guys did learn something. You found this video entertaining. Maybe you learned something new. Whatever it is, drop a like on this video. It really helps support the channel, and it definitely does help the channel grow. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new and turn on notifications and i will see you guys in the next video peace hey guys i just want to give a quick shout out to the people whose names are listed for officially joining the channel as a member and if you are interested in joining there's a link in the description that will take you there and some information on exclusive perks you get for joining as a thank you from me to you remember this is not required by any means and i appreciate all the support whether you're a member or not all right i'll see you guys in the next video peace